What is up YouTube, Double A12 here, and as you guys can see by the title, I'll be teaching you guys how to change your skins on, um, Minecraft Pollution like I do, because I have the zombie, um, skin with a black t-shirt. So, um, it's a fairly simple way to do it. You can do it if you're jailbroken and if you're not, but the jail unjailbreak method is basically the same as long as you can SSH into your device properly. And if you guys don't know what SSH is, then, um, Search it up on YouTube. I'm pretty sure someone else has a tutorial on that, but I'm going to be showing the jailbreak method. Um, and the two things you will need is iFile and a skin, obviously. A skin you're willing to change into. So, um, yeah, I'll be back in a sec to show you guys how to get this to work. So, um, one sec, guys. One sec. Okay, guys, I apologize for you guys who have to watch on a computer right now, and I know the screen is kind of small right now, but still, you guys gotta have to deal with it, because now I'll show you guys, um, how to change your skin. But first, you guys should have, um, downloaded a skin, and I recommend using, um, Safari Download Manager, which is a jailbroken app, to find your skin, to download the picture instead of, um, saving it into your photos. That way, you can just save, download your photo right here. So, um, the skin I chose, obviously, was... Sorry, I have a bunch of crap here that I haven't deleted yet. So, um, where is it? Where is it? I downloaded my skin right here. So, um, obviously, it, it wasn't called characters.png. But still. And there it is. That's how a skin is supposed to look like zombie with black t-shirt. So, what you would do now is change it to... char.png or car.png. Short for character, I believe. By clicking this blue arrow right here and then just changing the name right there. So the next thing you would do is edit and, um, obviously copy it. Now, I already bookmarked where my, um, Minecraft app is, but some of you guys can't find it. So, first thing I would do, but, but just in case you guys don't want a skin, I'd recommend, um, backing up the Minecraft.app file. Just in case, you know, you guys, it's, it's also the same way to install texture packs, but... I can go more into depth in that to it in a different video, but still, you'd go to applications, but, um, there's something weird about your applications if you're on iFile. If I'm correct, it shows a bunch of random numbers and letters, unlike mine, where it shows the actual thing. So, um, you'd go here, you see this little gear in the corner, you'd click that, and then click File Viewers. And, oh, actually, no, it's the wrong one. Which one was it? File Manager, I believe. And, um, here's the thing... This application names has to be on, because if it's off, you are going to get this. You can't tell which one is Minecraft, um, you know, Pocket Edition. So, have that on, and that will change everything into its original file name. So, um, next thing I would do, you just go all the way down to Minecraft PE. That's right, guys, Minecraft PE. Then you click Minecraft PE dot app. And if you guys are going to install a texture pack, you just basically copy and paste everything here, obviously. So then you edit, and then you paste it, and you should overwrite it. Don't forget to keep a backup of the original skin, just in case um you need the original skin. So, um, yeah, guys, that is basically the short way of doing this. So, um, yeah, let's go back into the world and see if it worked. Okay, guys. It appears it did work, but the thing is, we did have the skin on earlier, so you guys are just gonna have to trust me on that one. Um, you can also change the, um, zombie skins and the skins of other mobs to anything you desire. It's sort of, um, it's actually pretty easy. You can also change the textures by doing that as well, by changing to terrain.png. But it's overall a really, really easy way to, um, you know... Get stuff like this done. So yeah, guys, if you guys enjoyed the video, leave a like. Um, comment if you want to see any other tutorials that you guys have seen me do on Minecraft Power Edition. Like, um, stuff that I can do, but you guys haven't figured out how to do it yet. So, once again, guys, if you guys are new to the channel, subscribe. I do have a Let's Play going on of Minecraft Power Edition where I do, you know, play on a different world. It's just a world I made five minutes ago. So, um, yeah, guys. Once again, if you're new, comment, like, and subscribe. This has been Arisamon12 signing out. So, um, peace, guys. And I'll see you guys in the next video.